All right, so we're here at TTT Auto Recycling, and just so happens we've got a 95 right-hand drive Toyota Supra, the twin turbo. This car is beautiful. Let's take a walk around it. Now, of course, this is being right-hand drive, it was imported from Japan. Got the carbon fiber spoiler on back. Great looking car, coffee can exhaust. And basically the owner told me that this car and the Mitsubishi VR4, they bought as part of their personal collection. So I did try to make an offer today on the cars, but neither one of them are for sale. So let's check out the Super first. Definitely looks like it's been lowered. Got some nice wheel fitment there. And we've got a gorgeous interior. Now the interior of these cars are some of the, my favorite parts. It's a true jet fighter cockpit wraparound setup. Now you're gonna notice that this car does have the airbag steering wheel so we don't have a nardi or a momo but that's fine and i've always loved the body style of these cars we all know that they're appreciating in value and especially since the pandemic hit these cars have just gone crazy as far as the value goes and this one is beautiful it looks like it has original paint is that right yeah how many miles 67 67,000 miles. So we're looking at a Supra that's well under 100,000 miles, imported from Japan, original paint. What a gorgeous looking car. Come around up here to the front. Now my viewers out there can help me. You guys can let me know if these are the stock headlights. They look a little smoked to me, but I do have my sunglasses on. So I'm not totally for sure. But of course, this car has the iconic 2JZ twin turbo motor in it. So what a beauty. And moving over here, we've got a 1992 Mitsubishi VR4. So if you've been watching the video, you know, we started the day in my 95 uh, Mitsubishi. So this would have been the body style before the car that I have. And you can tell that by coming around to the front and we've got the iconic pop-up headlights great looking car now this one is a usdm spec so we've got the steering wheel on the correct side and kind of looking at the interior we've got white on red and this one is also it looks like it is a six speed so we've got two manual uh, Japanese cars and I just, I love the aesthetics of the 3000 GT and who doesn't love pop-up headlights. And remember, if you like the content of this channel, go ahead, click subscribe, hit that notification bell up at the top so you can be alerted to the newest uploads of the channel. I really appreciate it.